Well, hello, I'm uh, Joseph Horam, and uh, I'm here as a new member of the Board of Directors for United Way of Laramie County. And I'm Carol Horam. We um, both love Cheyenne and um, have uh, been very involved in our community over the years, uh, both with hands-on volunteer work and also by uh, contributing to the United Way Fund. We have been uh, residents of Cheyenne now 24 years, and so you know we've always been uh, contributing to the United Way cause. It just has sort of come natural uh, from year to year, and we've seen the the great uh, um, benefits that uh, supporting United Way has for the Cheyenne community. Um, I'd like to add that uh, in my, my work uh, background, I'm a pediatrician with uh, Cheyenne Regional Medical Center and also the medical director for Blue Cross Blue Shield of Wyoming. So I find that in my work capacity, um, I uh, really want to support our community as well and see that we uh, grow and thrive. We would love to see you strongly consider donating to the United Way Fund. One thing I'd like to do is uh, relate to some personal experience with United Way and it goes back to my childhood and that uh, when I grew up in Denver, Colorado, I had two brothers with uh, a disability and a special need. Uh, they had uh, quadriplegic cerebral palsy and when their uh, years of, of, of growing up was void of an education and void of developmental services, it turned out that there was an innovative program with uh, United Way uh, in Denver and it was a program that became a first of its kind in the nation. Uh, it was called the United Way Cerebral Palsy Center and from that my brothers were enrolled in a program that provided education and developmental services throughout their childhood years into their adolescent years and even as young adults they were uh, partially employed in their workshop. So that uh, personal experience has always been an important uh, kind of remembrance for me of the importance of United Way. And then uh, now that I'm uh, in a practice with uh, the fact that I can refer patients for resources uh, within United Way Larimer County, uh, that's been very important, such as uh, referring children to Boys and Girls Club, they can get recreational and educational services. Um, if there's domestic abuse uh, sometimes that occurs in families, it can be re referred to Safe Harbor for safety. And um, for example, another is Peak Wellness, where mental health services are very important and they can be um, provided to uh, the, uh, the families in a way that's just very supportive and uh, important. And I have been a 20 plus year driver for Meals on Wheels, and also I have been a past volunteer for the Camilla Shelter, uh, two organizations that are funded by United Way. And um, just with my experience and my involvement in these organizations, I see firsthand the importance of a well-funded organization in our community. So when you give to United Way, you can be sure that it is making a difference in Laramie County. Another thing I'd like to add is that uh, United Way Laramie County uh, annually supports uh, over uh, 20 to 25 programs. And there are some, some uh, programs that you may recognize as being familiar, but a number of the programs are smaller in scale. And it's important to provide uh, for these uh, various services uh, because they may not exist without United Way support. I would also say that there's an important um, concept of assuring that the uh, social determinants of health are really uh, taken care of in our community. And what I mean by that is things that have to do with education, uh, nutrition, transportation, health access, housing, all of these things um, are supported in one way or another by United Way and the entire benefit to the community is tremendous. So my plea is that uh, you consider um, your donations to support United Way in a way that uh, makes us stronger and it's an important investment in your community.